everybody, my name is Alicia, and today we're going to talk about a few words that might be useful for the New Year's holiday. So let's begin. All right, the first phrase is just New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve refers to the last day of the year, December 31st. It's the night before January 1st, the eve of the new year. New Year's Eve is traditionally、uh, a very fun, happy evening where people get together with their friends and their family. They might enjoy champagne. It's a big party. Okay. Oh, I've already mentioned this, but champagne. Champagne is a traditional, I guess, New Year's drink, a bubbly alcoholic drink. When the clock hits midnight, people might open a bottle of champagne and share it among all their friends.、Uh, it's supposed to be kind of a cheery, happy way to ring in the new year. I really enjoy sharing a glass of champagne with my friends on New Year's Eve. The next word is confetti. Confetti is really, really small, brightly colored paper. When there's a party or a New Year's Eve, people might throw or spray confetti, flashy and colorful, and maybe seems exciting. On the day, on <laughs> try it again. Confetti is everywhere on the streets of New York City on January first. All right. The next word is resolution. Goal for yourself. Many people set a New Year's resolution on January first or in that first week of January, which is the things that they want to accomplish during that year. I do this. Maybe you do this. Some common ones are, for example, to lose weight or to start going back to the gym or to reconnect with old family members and friends. Sticking to your resolution can often be really difficult. For 2015, my resolution is to become fluent in another language. The next word is countdown. Ten to zero countdown of the last ten seconds of the year. So people usually count down the last ten seconds together in really big voices. And when it reaches zero, everybody yells "Happy New Year" at the end of the countdown. You might hear about a countdown party where everybody comes together just for that. In a sentence, I'm going to a countdown party this year. It should be a lot of fun. The next word is Times Square. Times Square refers to a very, very popular and busy location in New York City. It is the location where the New Year's Eve ball drops in New York, and it's broadcast all over America and I think the world really. It's kind of the quintessential. Yeah, it's a really iconic New Year's Eve party. So you might see this on TV. People celebrating in Times Square. In a sentence, Times Square is so crowded on New Year's Eve. Be careful. And. <laughs> That's the end. That's the end of some words that you might need, or you might—I don't know. Those are words. New Year's, Happy New Year! If you have any New Year's resolutions, any goals for yourself for 2015, please be sure to leave us a comment and let us know what they are. Have a happy New Year, and we'll see you again soon. Bye. Oh, oh,、uh, okay.